Come here. Hi, sweetie. Hi. You're shedding. Yes, you are. How are you, baby? Hi. <laughs> No sugar. Oh goodness, get all this baby fuzz off. Yeah. Where are all your other friends? Don't, don't headbutt me. <laughs> Go get you some food. Go eat. guys you're growing like a weed finally losing all your hair hi mama how's your baby I don't think he'll let me pet him anymore hi cash hi hi baby you remember me? No, not today. Now these two are gonna be getting weaned before long. Hi girls. Yeah, hi baby. I'm almost thinking she may have weaned him already. She doesn't have much of a bed. Hello. You one of the ones that got away? You're getting a truck wash. What about that one? That's eating your truck. Look at all them. JW's calves are outcast. <laughs> Baby Val. Val. You're a good looking kid right there. Husband. He looks good. Is that next T-bone? Yeah. His mama's part Brangus. So he's got cute little floppy ears. <laughs> floppy. Bye, Val. Excuse me. We'll see you later. Say bye. Very cranky. <laughs> She's my friend, not yours. I know. I saved her. I fed her, though.
All right, you be good. Early morning on the farm. Just out here brush hogging the, the weeds in the hay pan so we can stack more hay in here and the weeds just grow back because that's what weeds do. Get this done and then uh, at least start stacking the oat hay in the field for when I have help with the trailer. And then, uh, well, there's the trailer. I need a driver and a truck at the moment. But then uh, we'll get it put over here in a pen and this will be its home for the next six months. It's kind of boring actually. So. You're not missing a whole lot. Hey guys. Oh. We just passed a, a neighbor of ours that bought one of our longhorns. So I had to look. But anyways. Should have been fast. She would have filmed it. Yeah, I couldn't flip my camera over fast enough. She looked really good though. But uh, I thought I would come on here. Um, we had a slight scare this morning um, while Aaron was out at our farm ground moving our um, oat bales and stacking them up. He noticed there were a pack of dogs, I say a pack, three of them, that were chasing... Um, Somewhere like a flock. A flock, I think they call it a pack. Anyways, they were chasing our calves that we have over here, like where Waylon is. Um, oh no, not Waylon. Yeah. <laughs> and so um, he took care of the uh, situation as best as possible at the given time. Um, but we he wasn't able to see everybody and so we're on our way out now to go and make sure we have everybody accounted for and nobody's hurt or had chunks of legs taken out or anything like that so hopefully hopefully we find everybody but I thought I'd come on here and show you um, the process of us finding everybody because people can't keep their dogs on their own property and or dumped them out here so hang tight and let's go see if we can find everyone while we're on our way to find the calves his uh, teff grass that he planted is looking really, really good. It looks so good. I incorporated it with the weeds. <laughs> oh, it's taller than your weeds now, at least. So. I'll be ready to cut in the next, what, month or so, probably? 15 days. 15 days from now. You might be having a baby 15 days from now. It'll be over by then. <laughs> about this tough grass, they say you should be able to cut it several times a season. So hopefully we get a lot of hay from it. It looks good. It liked the rain. Hi, Waylon. I think a big bad dog's chasing you guys today. Huh? I'm sorry. Waylon, I don't think I can pet you. I don't want to get shocked. My belly sticks out further than it should now. Hi, don't get shocked. I'll feel bad. Hi, sweetie. <laughs> Hi, 
I can't step like that right now. Oh, they, oh, they got shocked. Everybody. One, two, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I can't see twenty three, but I'm not in the right spot. Count with my toes. His horns are doing some pretty cool stuff. They're going backwards. <laughs> well, it looks like everybody's here, so. That one does have some marks on her back leg. That one does have some marks on her back legs. He has marks on his back legs. Oh, this guy here, when he turns around, he's got scrapes down his back legs. This one closest to us. See him? Uh, I assume probably from if they were actually nipping at him. I'm gonna get shocked. No, if I don't touch it, I can touch this one. Yeah, that's me a bitch. I saw it. You do not cuss on YouTube. Wait, let's be in a bully. Now you're filming? No, I'm filming in your head. Hello, guy. You're growing. I wish he'd move so we could see the back legs more. But at least everyone's here. So hopefully those dogs don't come back. What are you doing? Last year, if you guys remember, well, I guess earlier this year, we fill this creep feeder up and it's portable. You move it to where your calves are. Now that these girls don't have any babies out here, he's gonna fold this up and take it to the co-op in the morning and fill it up, take it to... Uh, I am not I'm going to the mill. Oh. Are going to start a GoFundMe page for that? Huh? We're going to start a GoFundMe page for that? I don't know how to do that. <laughs> well, 
These things are so darn expensive, but. Is she usually the one with the raspy? We're taking, we're taking donations of three C is interesting. And these wonderful three feeders. <laughs> We got a girl out here. Every summer her allergies flare up pretty bad. So if y'all can hear her breathing, she's fine. She just gets a goopy nose or gets a raspy sound in her lungs. What are you doing? Your friends over here. That's Aaron's cow. Your baldy. Or brockle, I guess, whatever you want to call her. Patiently waiting for their food. Really? Yeah. Yeah, we don't own power tools. Too bad you don't want to just get them out. Excuse me. Any power tools here? I don't know. Maybe you have some back there? No. Are there any power tools in the barn? No. No. You know what? Huh. Your father has started on a toolbox. Mm hmm. Hi, girls. So, all these girls will be having babies in September? Around there? September, October? This is the pasture you guys saw Aaron spraying in the last video. Let me show you some of the weeds are already croaking over. Blackberries are, so that's good. We like to see uh, dying weeds. Wonderful. Yep. It'd be better if they put the tires on the side and doing, we don't have to pick the hitch out. You're doing a great job. You're doing a wonderful job. Guess I could pull this pin for you, huh? A lot of spider webs. Uh, no more spiders. The handle okay hanging down?
gonna be nice if you had a big toolbox or something back here. You need an inhaler. Yeah, you do. Need some allergy medicine. Now he's just putting lights on it to drive legally. There's magnet up there. Hi girls. Hi. That'd be a cute picture right there. Look at that cute picture. What would be if I wasn't videoing? See, I told you his friend. Not today, because I'm videoing now. <laughs> they're not in our You got dirt on your shirt? I got more than dirt. It's baby. Sorry, I keep yawning in the background, guys. And not necessary, but that helps him not rattle. So that's what he was doing that for. Let's go feed everybody now. Then we'll come back and hook up to that. Definitely getting the hydraulic shoot in the next feeder. Now I'm gonna go count them. I'm gonna have to take off my shoes. Must be nice to be able to push things. Is it? I couldn't do that. They're hungry again. Poor things, they're so neglected. Even got a protein tub over there and they still think they're hungry. Yeah. 
We'll see you girls later. And this is me going to save a hummingbird today. Dude, you gotta land. What's up, little guy? You're welcome. This is on the list to spray. Maybe this week. We'll see what happens. What's up, dude? What do we have down here? We have a donkey. She doesn't like people. Must be the baby. Out here feeding some cows. Brought the creep feeder. And you see, it's just in their nature to figure out how to eat. Would you shut up? It's just in their nature to be able to eat the most expensive thing in sight. And they go straight for it. Man, that one doesn't have a tag. If I don't have the tag box, I bet he'd be a little easier to tackle in a creep feeder. He wants in there, but he does, he's not so sure he can fit, I promise. I'll promise him he can't. Oh, hush. All right, well, back to whatever else uh, there is to do today. Well, go over here to the post office today and, uh, well, Brett has officially got his first package. I mean, it's even addressed to him and everything. The wife doesn't know I'm here. It'll be a surprise when I get home. Well, let's see here. All right, well, I guess, uh, well, it's only like two o'clock, so definitely have to go find something else to do. Maybe build some fence. We shall see. Ruger, stop breathing. You're like. <sighs> He's hot outside. That's what you get for leaving him outside all day. They were inside. You got okay. You gotta tilt it up so I can't see the address. We got a package. No, the, we did not get a package. We did not. <gasps> Rhett got a package. They're going to know that because I took a video at the post office. Oh. But I also said my wife didn't know about it. So. I didn't know about it till just now. But this looks like, hopefully she doesn't mind. Let me open it first. Yeah, yeah. I learned that lesson. You really need to know. Mm -hmm. If I could know, it would make Rick come along faster. Is that so? Oh my gosh, there's a letter. You can read the letter later. I will. 
But you're reading it now? I want to make sure that she's okay with us saying her name. I will read this in a little bit, but it's from, I believe it's Sandra, Sandra Elkins. Sorry if I said your name wrong. Uh, from Utah. Definitely a blank. Oh, look how cute. Ruger. Can you see it? Stop moving. Ruger, go on. There's a teddy bear. There's and then a the back of it. That's so oh, cute. Oh, hang on. I see a cat <laughs> and an owl. And I I, I think that was a donkey. So that is really cute. Thank you so much. Like I said, I'll read this here in a minute. But... Um, a lot of you have been asking when we're due and, and everything like that. And, uh, My hand's cramping. <laughs> I can tell you um, he'll most likely be here next week. Your phone's... I know my phone's ringing and I'm shaking. <laughs> Use your other hand. Um, uh, I am using both hands. <laughs> so he uh, will most likely be here next week. Um, uh, hang with us a little bit. Our life's going to dramatically change, so we will uh, try our hardest to keep you guys... No, it's not. It's just like Val all over again. It's just like Val. Mm -hmm. Except we can't leave him in a stall and say see you in a couple hours. It's what the nursery's for. <laughs> so, hang with us. Um, we'll try our hardest to keep you guys updated and, and everything on it all, but we'll, uh, if we go incognito for a little while, you know why. So, okay, let me see. Come here. What are we seeing? The cowlick. <laughs> but, anywho... That's all we have. Uh, thank you again for this. It's beautiful. It's going to uh, probably go in the wash. If it can be washed, I'll read that. But um, go in the wash and then go in the nursery. And hopefully the next video you guys see, we'll try to get one this weekend while we can. But then hopefully after that, to be a baby.